guys now after i'm done eating my breakfast i am going to take you to throughout and walk you through my day uh, how a typical day in my life is like will it will actually help you have a sneak peek into a lawyer's life here in canada obviously i'm not going to share the confidential information of my clients or the files i'm working on at the moment but what i do need to share with you is the kind of work that i'm doing so that that has no problem to it so basically i have a case management conference today uh, with an uh, with the minister's council because one of my client is in it is in detention because of inadmissibility so i'm going to try and get him out today and that's my main agenda that i've been working for like the past one week then i have a startup visa program for which i have to prepare a file then i do have some business migration cases as others as well which i'm going to share with you and what i am doing in that so you will have some kind of idea on how i work how i operate how the firm runs i have two more partners but they are not here typically right now they are in back home in their countries but uh, right now right now i will walk you through my day i hope you like this video in the end if you do hit the like button because i'm going to cover the whole day so i think it should be interesting for you and um, if you like this vlog then i will be you know more than happy to make such more creative vlogs for you guys and thank you and my first thing that i do the primarily most important thing i consider is to open and check your mails i work in a lot of business immigration cases so i typically know that even it's uh, a night time in probably the asian countries and middle east then i would have certainly some mails because my clients would certainly be awake that time so i do tend to check all of them and specifically because you know in canada you are working from 8 to 4 so basically 8 am to 4 am is a very crucial Crucial time for us because we have to talk to lawyers, opposite lawyers. We have to do so much in our uh, in a, in a in a stage where we do litigation. Like we do have a detention hearing, as I told you, and the review hearing is today. The client has been charged with some serious uh, uh, organized criminality charges, due to which you become inadmissible in Canada. So basically, I am taking two kind of defense for his detention. Is one is the the evidence for his case is not that strong because just because he lacked that kind of knowledge and they have not been able to, in my opinion, uh, been able to establish that. So basically, one of our defense is that, and the second defense that I'm going to do is that he already had a bonds person in place. So they have questioned the bond. person like so many times and now i just want to make sure that i'm able to get him out before the christmas vacation you should you do so much immigration has so many branches so one of the things that i specialize right now is specifically dealing with human rights with the detainees so 
Uh, now let's see. I have a case management conference today. I've opened my laptop, and uh, by the way, I just love using the Surface Go Pro of Microsoft just because of the simple reason that I'm able to uh, even edit and you know use it with the stylus and mark the PDFs, make my own notes, and save so much of paper. And I do recommend anybody who's running in a practice should now and you know in such uncertain times we've been able to. Uh, established on that uncharted territory and we need to we need to understand the importance of going offline working uh, from home and you know having all the all the database uh, at the cloud storage so that's one of my tips for everybody that try and maintain soft records hard copies are now an old thing to do to maintain soft records so i will just be back from my case management conference and would it's a telephony conference but i would definitely let you know that what exactly happened with that client So guys, yes, uh, the case management conference went really well. Now what uh, the minister's council has asked me, she has asked me to send her the written proposal for the release plan. She is not just willing to release him with, with one bonds person. Basically, bonds person is a performance guarantor, like a surety in typically in our countries in a criminal matter. Uh, she wants as well the EVM bracelet to go on with him. That's the electronic uh, surveillance uh, bracelet. Just because of the simple reason that the charges are really serious and they do consider the cli my client a threat to the public. So, no, all in all, maybe my client is ready with this because he just wants to get out of the detention center. And I am really happy because it's very difficult to convince the government or council to basically release the detainee as well because she says the decision is subjudice. But whatever it is, uh, we've got him released and that's very exciting news for the day. On another note, I have one person coming in at 12 p.m. for a startup visa meeting and uh, that is what I'm going to work on. Startup visa is basically an immigration program through which a lot of people immigrate and uh, not everybody fits into every group but I do tend to do a lot of that. So I'm going to assess him. We have his initial consultation today at 12. And uh, thereafter, I have one very interesting case coming in of a corporate client who is a very close client, like he gives all his corporate work to us, plus his company from incorporation, he's going to wanting to make it a public uh, listed company. So we have to go through the Canadian security exchange process. And I have never done this before, but I'm super excited to do it now. So I will keep you updated about it. Uh, Hina and Arshdeep work in the same cabin as I do because I tend to keep them here with me because there are a lot of to-do things that I keep telling them. They are however not in today because we do not really have a timing from 8 to 7 or 8 to 5. Our firm does not work like that. What I do personally and I think is the freedom of working anywhere and that's what I believe in because you know business immigration and our mostly work is investment based, immigration based which we can do from online and which is also night based. So these guys are like my stress because they are also working at night dealing with overseas clients and talking to them so I do not have any any time limitations for them then hi to Hina you have to come in come in And I would like everybody to meet him. He is very interesting and he has something to say to us. So that's Arshdeep and he's in like a ready steady position <laughs> to just tell us about himself and what a typical day in his life at East Law is. And you can see his smile. <laughs> <laughs> Hi everyone, I, my name is Arshdeep and I work here in East Law. Pe. Wonderful team ke saath kaam karta hoon, jaha pe Hina hai, Shreen ma'am hai. So the, the great thing about it is it's a very fun, loving environment and um, where everybody uplifts everyone and hume uh, bohat seekhne ko milta hai har roz. It's like a family environment, not family environment, it's not a family gathering though. But yes, I mean, uh, uh, we work under uh, uh, a very uh, light environment jaha pe uh, you know, you're allowed to uh, share your ideas and um, jo bhi aapke views hain, jo bhi aapke thoughts hain. So, 
that is one thing everybody looks for uh, at at a at a works workplace exactly i think it's very important that uh, we share our opinions with each other True. because if we don't do that then our horizons are very limited Absolutely. and currently i'm working at a lot of uh, files like lmii key files uh, spouse uh, spouse sponsorship yeah, family sponsorship hogi startup visa ho gaya uh, intra company transfer ho gaya so all of these i'm karta hu every day and uh, that's how my typical day uh, looks like and uh, obviously it includes a lot of fun with uh, my colleagues इस लॉ में मेरा हर दिन एक नया दिन होता है ऑफ कोर्स मुझे हर दिन कुछ ना कुछ नया सीखने को मिलता है मेरा दिन स्टार्ट होता है मैं सबसे पहले ऑफिस आती हूँ तो मेरा काम होता है कि मैंने अपनी मेल्स चेक करनी होती हैं और जो मेल्स होती हैं मुझे उनका रिप्लाई करना होता है एंड रिप्लाई करने के बाद मैंने मैम का वर्क ऑफ द डे बनाना होता है टू डू लिस्ट बनानी होती है मैम को वो देनी होती है बाद मुझे जो मीटिंग्स होती है मैंने उन मीटिंग्स का एक टाइमिंग सेट की होती है एवरी डे इज अ न्यू डे तो yeah. बहुत अच्छा लगता है फन भी है काम भी है सो आई आई एम द गाय हु प्लेज वेरी गुड म्यूजिक यस आई एम आई एम एक्चुअली एम अ I'm a, a I'm doing side hustle. I'm 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 a DJ. Wow! I'm so a... it's four degrees outside, and it's a beautiful temperature. We usually see view at night at nine ten till nine ten. It's the same view. Cars are going on, and we have nothing else to look at. But we do have these posts, which we keep doing that all around our office. As you can see, we all write our to do list. And it's like fun to you know just read it and then take it off whenever we have finished the dad work. And so has Hina also done at her place. But and Hina also writes some kind of quotes every day when she comes in here. As you guys must have seen, we keep having these fun kind of bits in between. But yes, we that does not mean we don't work. We really do a lot of hard work, but just to have fun around because that's how you make the atmosphere light, right? You don't always have to be serious just because you're a lawyer or you are working on a serious case. You have to relax, chill, uh, live, love, and laugh with everybody around you, and that is the second thing that keeps us going. So today we also have a very interesting meeting with one of the persons who's coming in to show that, by the way, Arshi, he ha- the person has no status in Canada. So we have to get him through a status in Canada, and then we would have to go through his permanent residency, and we'll see how we do it. So all of that is and in as our- discussed. Ab ho gayi hai bar raat. और अर्शिया भी काम कर रहा है That's what a typical day in our office looks like. So if you enjoy this vlog, hit the like button. Take care. Bye bye.